welcome back to Kathy's Vegan Kitchen. Today we're making a vegan sushi bowl. Instead of making sushi rolls, we're going to throw all the stuff in a bowl, which is much easier than making sushi. Now this is an optional ingredient, but we're going to add it tonight. I have some extra firm tofu that I already marinated overnight in a quarter cup of soy sauce and two teaspoons of sriracha. And I'm going to air fry it at 375 for seven to 10 minutes. And you want to move it around a little bit if you have one of those round air fryers and it doesn't have that gap in between. I'm also cooking one cup of brown rice. Yes, I know that brown rice is not typically in sushi, but it's healthier, so we like brown rice. But you can use jasmine rice or white rice if you like that. And I'm cooking the one cup of organic dry rice in two cups of water for 30 minutes and it's already cooking because you don't want to watch me boil water and cook rice. And then we have a bunch of different ingredients. I have some green onions here. I have some fresh mango. I have cucumbers. I have mame, which is shelled edamame. I have red bell peppers. I have seaweed that's chopped up. Um, you can do that with a nori sheet. I have shredded carrots chopped up red cabbage, some kimchi. I made a cute little rose out of ginger that is super easy to make. We're just going to twirl it together and hold it together with a toothpick. And then we're going to make some sauce. So I'm going to throw this into the air fryer and then we'll come back and make the sauce. For the sauce, I have a half a cup of dried cashews. I have a tablespoon of soy sauce a tablespoon of maple syrup. Now I like it hot, so I'm using a tablespoon of sriracha. But if you don't like it hot, start with like a, like a quarter of a teaspoon and move your way up to get the, the amount that you like. And it says that in the directions to not go crazy with that sriracha unless you like it hot. A quarter cup of water and one tablespoon of lemon juice. Gives it nice freshness. And then we're gonna pop the top on. And we're gonna let it do its blending thing. The rice is nice and fluffy. The tofu, perfectly yummy. And now I'm going to add a couple of teaspoons of rice vinegar to the rice just to give it a little flavor. That's my measurement, two teaspoons. Just to give it a little bit of flavor. And then we're going to assemble the bowl. Of course, Paul gets his bowl first. So I'm gonna take rice and I'm going to put it in the middle of the bowl. And then I'm going to give them a little more. Okay, then I'm going to add the ingredients. So I have five green onions. And what I like to do is I like to put the green onions over the top of the rice. And then this is one nori um, sushi sheet of seaweed that I crumbled up. And then I like to crumble the seaweed on top because it gives the rice incredible flavor. Then what I want to do is this is one large mango cut up. I'm going to put the ingredients on the sides so then Paul can mix it in. I have one cup of kimchi. I have a quarter cup of red cabbage and you can add any veggies that you like. I have one cucumber or one cup of cucumbers. I have the mame, which is one cup. I bought it frozen and I cooked it and then chilled it again because you have kind of a hot bowl with kind of the cold ingredients. Then I have red bell peppers. And I have carrots and I have one cup of carrots and that was one red bell pepper. Okay, then we're going to add the tofu pieces on top. Oops. And 
And then Paul's going to get a little ginger rose right in the middle. And if you look at the sauce, it's nice and creamy. It wasn't too spicy. I'm going to put it in a side dish for him so he can dip or drizzle whatever he prefers. And that is a sushi bowl, vegan style. Okay, here we go. Right. Paul's taste testing the, the vegan sushi bowl. First off, I'm going to drizzle. Drizzle. Drizzle my drizzle. Drizzle my Okay, mix it in a little bit. I don't know where to start. I'm gonna do a little some rice, mame, mame. I broke it half. Ooh, that's good. Hmm. Some mango kimchi. A lot going on in here. You can mix it all together hmm. too if you want. Why do I think? So. It's too bad they haven't invented Taste Vision yet, because people watching this channel would love to taste this. Taste Vision. Taste Vision. Or smell vision. Oh, smell vision, that would be good. Yeah, it's delicious. All right, we'll see you Can't next time, everybody. Bye. Don't forget to comment. Vegan sushi bowl. Yummy, yummy. See you next time. Bye.